British ships fired rockets and cannons at the fort. There was an American lawyer on one of the ships named Francis Scott Key. He waited all night during the battle, wondering if the American flag would still be flying from the fort in the morning. While he waited, he wrote a poem about the flag called the Star Spangled Banner. He set the poem to music, and that song became our national anthem. About God or the Bible, and the government cannot stop anyone from going to church or starting a church. Many people come to America so that they can speak their minds freely. Also, many people come to America so they can worship God whatever way they believe is right. We should be thankful for freedom of speech and freedom of religion. Called the Declaration of Independence. The Declaration of Independence explained the reasons why they wanted to be a separate country. The Declaration of Independence says that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights, and that amongst these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Our country was founded on these principles, so they are very important. These principles are also taught in the Bible. All men are created equal. This means that everyone has equal value because God made them. They are endowed by their creator by certain unalienable rights. This means that our rights come from God, and no one can take them away from us. Among these are life, liberty, and a pursuit of happiness. This means that everyone has a right to live. It also means that everyone has a right to live the way they want, as long as they are not stopping someone else from doing what they want to do. People from all over the world come to America because they want to be free. In other countries, people do not have as many freedoms as we have in America. We should be thankful that we live in a free country. My whole town is not like this, but that's all right. Coming the back. man who died, who gave that right to me, and I gladly stand.